Put your hands together, YBN Corday. That record is fire. We was just talking about it. I'm like, because the record would have ended with a lot of artists as soon as the verses ended, like that, that last hook. Yeah. But the musicality kept going, and then it goes into an interlude where y'all like then they have Bible study. Yeah, for sure. Because y'all do the have mercy kind of like prelude uh, yeah. at the end. Mm -hmm. It's like, again, it seems like you've put in a lot of thought into this to make it a complete work. And so we salute that. Oh, you know what I'm saying? That. You saw the heads. You know yeah. what I mean? Like it's that's that's incredible. Um, I appreciate that. There's a uh, there's a record that you, that I've seen you mention that you don't like to talk about, uh -huh. and it's Family Matters. Yeah. And uh, Family Matters is is it, why don't you like to talk about it? Tell tell everybody who's watching. Uh, just cause it's just all real. You know what I'm saying? This is all like just real life shit that people in my family are going through. Things I was going through knowing all of these things so i just not to try not to speak upon it too much you know what i'm saying that's that that the record was my therapy in it you know so i don't want to like get into it. i don't really like getting back into it now i i heard i saw you say that and i was like when i was writing down stuff because i'm like i i listened to the album like all the way through when i first got it and yeah I, and i sat at home i was in the driveway actually because i'm mm -hmm. like i don't i was like i'm just gonna listen to the rest of this oh dope. and when i got to family matters i sat there and i was like Yo, and I and I matter of fact, Johnny could tell you I wrote an email yeah. to him and Horace and all that. And I'm like, he's like, I'll show it to you. I was just like, <laughs> yo, I don't know if y'all know what y'all your child got right yeah. here. Because and, and and that song, again, it's not something you need to talk about a lot. Yeah. But that pain that's in that song yeah. is setting you up to for bigger, better things. And I say that because like Jay-Z, when he talked about selling selling work to his mom yeah. and shot his brother and you, you must love me. Or, or when Kanye talked about, you know, that horrific accident, you know, yeah. and, 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 and through the wire. And we look at all the comedians that say all of the great comedy and great movie scripts come from pain. Yeah. People look at you like, yo, he's given us all yeah. when you do something like that. Yeah, for sure. I'm, you know, my music is just, I'm just very vulnerable. You know what I'm saying? Very transparent. I can't, I don't care about no facade, no image. I'm just being as vulnerable as possible because we all human beings. You know what I'm saying? I'm the same as everybody in here. You know, we all are human beings at the end of the day, first and foremost. Yeah. So uh, <clears throat> the music is just me being transparent and vulnerable because it's important as an artist. Because writing that song was therapeutic for me. So somebody who may can relate to one of those things, you know, can help them, you know, go through their thing to let you know, like, we all go through the same shit, you know what I'm saying? It's just like, okay, he, you know, so yeah. Like he's like us. Yeah, exactly. Because that record put a lot of people through. in a position of feeling like they're in your shoes. For sure. And this is even some lines that was like too personal that I had to change. I had to take out. I saw you say that, though. Yeah. You took stuff out and it was still took, biting. Like yeah, I was like, exactly. yo, they going to kill him at Thanksgiving. But the thing is, the thing is, the thing is, I never, you know, I never said, I felt like I, I I treaded that line very tightly. I right. didn't say anybody names. You, you know didn't. what I'm saying? I didn't, didn't say anybody names at all to where only they would know. But, like, nobody, no outside people would know, like, nobody's names. They're like, oh, yeah, that's the auntie. That, hmm. You know what right. I'm saying? Like, I didn't say no names to where it would affect anybody's lives or nothing. So, but it's still some situations that it was like, oh, yeah. That's too like you said when you pinned it. Yeah, you was on a plane. Yeah, it was. I was on a plane from like back home, going back to. Uh, I think I was going to New York or L. A. And you just on the plane writing the shit. Yeah, because I said, had that beat for a while, and then I just started writing that joint. But yeah, I mean, it's like okay, we're gonna play the record. But now, Lou, here, listen, okay. listen, listen. Now it ain't because I'm not gonna ask you to tell anybody's story or whatever. Yeah, but. Is something that I think is a part of this because of what I said about the J, the Kanye's, the that pain is it's almost like having Reservoir Dogs without the without the grind. Yeah, it's like having you know all these big type of motion pictures. Yeah, and don't have that part. Yeah, for sure. And 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 it's crazy because your comment about your family supporting you after. Yeah. That was the crazy part. Like I was like, he ain't he ain't coming home for the holiday. Oh, you yeah. like, nah. I 
they they all because I didn't put them out there. They knew it wasn't me selling them out. Yeah, for you sure. You know what I'm saying? Like it, so, it they actually backed of, you. Yeah, yeah. No, nah, it's from a place of super love. You know what I'm saying? It ain't no. It's just love. You know what I'm saying? It's from a place of love and discernment and and you know just uh you know just straight pure love so none of them like it's, it was no like one family member might have said something you know what i'm saying but nobody else like the rest shut them down yeah <laughs> i nah, mean sure they couldn't yeah nah that's a, i mean they i had a nigga they had their own album release party called family matters like shut a, up yeah, on god <laughs> nigga on god literally <laughs> like like a week after like they dropped they had like a little celebration the family matters party dropping yeah, saturday literally. night yeah literally like all right yeah. well Here's the deal. I mean, because I, again, and I'm going to tell you this just as big homie type talk. There are people who are going to try and make this salacious. And there are people who are going to try and, you know, and try and play, make it a part of your story because they're like, ooh, ah. Yeah. But the same love that you're talking about from the family, the people who really kind of gravitate to what you're doing. Yeah. And kind of expecting you to walk across that Grammy stage are going to look at this as, as, as fuel for where you're headed. Yeah, for sure. So that's the only reason why I incorporated us into this. Now, if you tell me don't, uh -huh. we won't run it. But I think they need to hear it, and then we'll close out. Uh, what you think? I don't want to say don't, but uh, why you got to put the pressure on me, bro? Ain't no Damn. pressure. Ain't no pressure. You a young boss. So uh, I'm just letting you know that it's coming from a place of of the, your whole story because I don't think anybody in here after hearing your body of work is going to look at you and say oh that's the guy nah that's nah it has nothing to do nah nah it's nothing to do with that I just kind of like get emotional listening to it so I would like actually rather like and it would be better for y'all if y'all had time to like just listen to it on your own in solidarity you know what I'm saying because that's, that's good that was like the intent that I this ain't some shit you play in the club you know what I'm saying you know, we, I niggas. definitely would not play it in the club you know what I'm saying but, like this is not like something <laughs> like I had to clean and my daughters was in the back seat and yeah. I was like we gonna turn on Disney now yeah for sure cause I'm like I just you know even yeah, the, nah, for it sure, ain't even so. the dirty words it's the it's, it's the, the truth in yeah, it nah, and everything it's just, yeah and it's, it's nothing bad about it all it's just like just I feel like a bunch of people was like tweeting me saying like yo this song like we played it I played this song for like my dad and it brought us together closer because our family's going through like a lot of the similar situations and it op it's a conversation open it's nothing negative about this song at all I haven't no. heard anything negative at all it's just it's just pure honesty pure transparency so y'all rather like people hear it on their own when people That's reached out to you after hearing the song and saying they used it in that way, yeah, what did that make you feel? Oh, I was like, oh man, this is a, that's what I made it for. You know what I'm saying? With that, it just it just shows like how powerful music is. You know what I'm saying? Music, I take this shit. This is like a responsibility we have a, as musicians. Our music really affects people. You know what I'm saying? In a in a in a major way, music is therapeutic music. You listen to music when you work out. You listen to music when you're drawing. You listen to music when you're doing damn near every fucking thing. You know, so as as musicians, you know, we got to... That's why I take so much time. I don't take this shit lightly or for granted. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. Um, I'm going to ask you this question because I mentioned this before because you said this going to give me a Grammy. Uh... <laughs> Y'all know I'm, I'm going to hold them to this. Okay. What would uh, this rapper, superstar, hit record haver say as advice to TGI Corday? Uh, keep it going. You're doing everything you're supposed to do. Keep it going. I told them before you came in that I've done this with, with Cole back when he was Ball Caesar Cole. Uh, like no. way, way back. Low cut. Low cut cold, you yeah. know, fresh off of giving Jay Z his demo. Mm. Done this with the Ariana's, the Nicki Minaj's and all that. Oh, that's dope. And I gotta tell you, I predict you walking across that Grammy stage. Mm, I appreciate that, my brother. You know what I'm saying? See that. You know, so I, I'm saying I'm gonna put that in the air mm -hmm. uh and uh, and say keep doing it because we need people who got a message like this. In this game that that keeps getting 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 crapped on, mm. you know what I mean? Yeah, appreciate that. All right, put your That's hands love. together, please. <laughs> Why me and Corday? <laughs>